Hello everybody and welcome to another Not So Daily Vlogmas. Yes. Where are we at, Steph? We're in Rothenburg. We're in Rothenburg. So we've moved from, well we're not moving, we've travelled over to, from Nuremberg over to Rothenburg to, to experience another town for Christmas. Another Christ Christmas market. Because this place is really Christmassy. And also, we found out some information, well you found out some information, yeah. that um, a lot of Walt Disney films were like inspired. There's a statue in the German pavilion. Here. Yeah, so it's based on this one, and also yeah, a lot of movies were inspired by Rothenberg, apparently by the cities and stuff. So it's and going to be experiencing so interesting to try and find these out. What? And as well, it's always Christmas every single day. There. Pretty much. Yeah. So we're going to experience this, show you all, and hope you folks enjoy it. But if you're new to the channel, my name's Dave. This is Steph. Hi. And we are doing not so daily vlogmases, but we also do uh, travel. travel and lifestyle videos so if you are new to the channel or you watch the videos and don't subscribe we really would appreciate if you subscribe because we want to try and hit 30,000 subscribers by the end of the year if possible we're so close so it'd be awesome if you go help us out but let's get on with the video so we're just outside like the castle walls or the walls of Rothenburg I mean which way do we go? it's pretty amazing um well, can we go this way? I don't think you can, it's a oh. road. Let's be safe. Yeah. We're gonna go around the other side, but it looks very beautiful so far. German ducks. Hi, German ducks. Hi, German ducks. Oh. This is their moat, Steffi. Yeah, that's their moat. Tight uh, entrance for one car, but they make do. One thing I love the fact that they do here, or especially Rothenburg, they have trees. It's sort of like where lamp should be, it looks like. Or well, it should be like a lampshade, but they put it for trees. Definitely a tree. Every tree is used. Yeah. Just noticed some bubbles above us, and there's a bear blowing bubbles. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. I'm trying to get a better angle of this, but obviously they've put a case around it because I think they're trying to preserve it right now. Yeah. Um, but yeah, this is um, the Georgian Dragon statue, the original one, and the one in Epcot is inspired by this guy. It looks really different. Yeah, that's why we say inspired. It's not the replica, it's inspired by it. So they've taken aspects of it and just done their own version. And you know what? I didn't know this until I was, until I actually watched a YouTube video and I yes. went, that awfully, that looks a lot like the one on in Epcot. Yeah. I Wikipedia'd it and it is. <laughs> and I'm literally like, oh! really cool so there we go there's the real one okay welcome to christmas everybody this is christmas street right? this is christmas street <laughs> literally this is where you're gonna have all of your christmas shops your christmas museums i tell you they celebrate christmas like it's just christmas every day here Here, but I wanted to take a video of this Christmas tree because it looks so beautiful. Everything looks stunning. Okay. I'm really sorry. Um, I'm sorry, Rothenberg. Okay. Don't shout at me. Really sorry, but it's beautiful. Okay, I think we're literally in Christmas heaven. So, because it's really cold and we're hungry, and we've not had a table service in a long time, we thought we'd eat here in Rothenburg. Yeah. It looks like, it reminds me of a pub. It does, it reminds me of a pub, yeah. It's really cool. We've ordered a schnitzel each, and then we've also got some beers. You've got a big beer. 
Yeah. She wants she wants small or big? And you went big. So we're gonna see how big it is. Yeah, I'm gonna help you. So I went for a wheat beer with lemonade because I'm just you know shandy. Shandy. I've never really had a wheat beer with lemonade. There was there was another one that you saw on the menu which said Coke with it. Yeah. Wheat beer with Coke. So my shandy turned up with a big head. And look at Steph's big beer. Yeah. Enjoy stuff. How are you going to get through that head? I don't know. Schnitzels have arrived with the salads. That's a big schnitzel. Oh, look at that, that's my hand. It's the size of my hand. That's huge. Right. Mini update. I'm going to take a break. I'm going to feed. To feed as well. It's really nice. It's amazing. But yeah, there's a lot on there and we've only got halfway through it. So we just come out of the cafe, which was literally just there. It was so pretty. It was nice, it wasn't was it? So lovely. It was I really love good. Those in there. The schnitzel was good. The fries were good. The salad was good. The beer was good. The service was good. It was only thirty-one oh. euros for the. Yeah, she wasn't that badly priced. Decent. I liked it. But we're waiting because at one o'clock, I think. Oh, there you there go. go. It's happening. And then these windows oh, open. And. Yeah. <laughs> We like to do so. <laughs> so something to do with. It's about the elder trying to save his town. Yeah. And in order to save his town, he had to drink barrels of beer. There you in go. Order to save his town. So on the right, on the right, just here, there's a guy who's constantly drinking, and the guy on the left's watching him. I think. He's trying to save the town. So, what a way to save your town! Drink beer. All right. Sweet. See where this is going now, can't we? <laughs> so we're walking down this road, and apparently there is an iconic building down here. There is. It's like a postcard esque sort of area. I'm gonna go see it. Oh my cold. god, it's so cold. Oh my god, look at this. Look at that fruitcake down there, and there's a butter stolen as well. And these are the snowballs. Pretty different flavours, and then you get like the mini ones. But like a deep fried pastry. Yeah. That's then... that's like put into a, like a sphere and deep fried. Oh, oh there's a chef Dave. Chef Dave. Oh my god, look at all the salami. Salami. <gasps> oh hello. Lordy lord. That's a lot. That's a lot of salami. Oh, Ruffenberger, is that black pudding up there? Could be, yeah. Is another baker's. Oh my god, there's so many bakers. Oh, I do want to try like a Stalin, like a real traditional Stalin. I agree. We should try one. Because apparently, traditional Stalin doesn't have marzipan in it. Mm -hmm. Here it is. The picturesque sort of thing you normally see on a Germany. I think it's only German Ruffenberg like, postcard. Yeah. Do you know any history for it? <laughs> Alrighty, something that I actually wanted to go in. <laughs> We're going to go to the Criminal Museum. It's kind of like London Dungeons, but in Rothenburg. You always know one. Me. I do also want to look at this as well. Oh. Here you go, Dave. Stick in that. What have I done now? <laughs> That's more like it for you. Yeah. Perfect. I'll see you later, yeah? Have fun, yeah? <laughs> Can you get out? <laughs> Can I come in, please? I don't want any double glazing, go. So, we've been looking around, and this is the shame mask section. And we've been looking at these, and there's so many that we didn't realize. We just thought that they were just for anything. But there's purposes for different ones. Like, so this one this is one? for, um, which is used for so called blabber mouth women. <laughs> long ears meant that they heard everything, the glasses meant that they saw everything, and the long tongue meant they told everything as soon as it happened. Just blabbermouth, honestly. And then there was one for, there's one for gossips as well. So this one is for gossiping people, wow. wow. Yeah, this one so talk to women, talk to women. Talk to women. Ears, the bell rang upon each turning of the head. <laughs> wow. Um, Sadly that doesn't give any reasons to what that is, but that's a chicken. And this, and this one, one is, is a pig head. For someone who acted like a pig. Wow. <laughs> There's literally anything for any reason at all. You couldn't really do anything, could you? You, you, could, just, you just couldn't. Let's be quiet. 
Yeah. Couldn't say anything. No freedom of speech. Yeah. You probably literally couldn't even say it. You could have to talk about like, minimal. Now that was very interesting. We didn't want to show too much because obviously like if people were thinking of doing it then if we just showed all of it it would be kind of worth not if, worth if it. If you're into that sort of like crime and punishment if you're intrigued and not all that other stuff, it's worth Yeah, it was really good. It was seven euros per person, which I thought was pretty good value and you got a lot to see. Yeah, it was really amazing. And we're just heading through I think it's the gift shop, maybe the cafeteria, I don't know. I think I need to look at some Christmas stuff now. I was like, yes. oh gosh, there's too much, too much, uh, too much shame, too much going on right. Too now. much shame going on there. Let's let's, put, let's go back to Christmas. So this place, apparently, it's very good to eat at. Yeah. It's got a really good cellar, apparently, that you can eat down there. It's downstairs cellar you can eat in, but um, it's called uh, Zuhel or Zuhol, but I mean to, to hell. Fun times, but oh. apparently it's really good. It's really good food yeah. in there, and if you want like a good. Rothenberg meal. Yeah, go okay. there. That's your, that's your place to go. It doesn't open until 5 o'clock today. So. Cheers, cheers. I don't Some know how many glue wines I've had. <laughs> enough. But we've got another set, we've got another mug to take home. One Yay! from, one from Nuremberg. Glue. Yeah, one from Nuremberg, one from Rothenburg. So yeah, add to the collection. <laughs> Finding the right snowball one. Are we going to the, this? Can was the this first one, wasn't it? That we yeah, looked at. one a while ago. Yeah. Okay. So right. I think this might be the place. Well, the cocoa, which is just like I think it's like a dark chocolate with nuts. And mm. then Steph, no, Steffi went for the nuts. I went for just cocoa. So we're going to try these out. Go for it. Let's go for it. Now, how do we take them out? So I just put my hand in it. That one's yours. So, so which one did you? You got coconut. I don't think you would like coconut. Oh, I thought it was cocoa. Oh well. So let's give it a try. I don't know how so you, you eat. You can try this one. If you like this one, I'll eat yours. It's quite crumbly. It is very crumbly, isn't it? I can't say it's like a shortbread. Okay. But like covered in deep dark. fried. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is like a like a like a, a gobstopper or something. Just <laughs> keep you entertained for hours. Just try and eat this. You need a knife and fork, I'd say. Now, I would suggest doing it a complete opposite of how I did it. Yeah, because I've got gloves on. Just eat it like an apple. <laughs> I have to get one of your five a day. It's really weird texture, isn't it? When was this made? I don't know. I thought today. Quite crumbly. Mm -hmm. On pastry and chocolate. It's like pastry that's been left out overnight. Oh. That's what it tastes like. Oh, okay. I taste no marzipan. Oh, I don't know what to think of that. Were you expecting something else? Mm. <laughs> you found the marzipan. Good, good. There is, it's there in the middle somewhere. In Rothenburg, when you get your cup of glue wine, yep. you have to pay a deposit for yeah. the cup. But when you return it, you go to this little cubby hole here, this lady will give you back your two euros. We're keeping one as a souvenir though, but 
as everything is so gorgeously lit here at Rothenburg, we have to say our goodbyes. Goodbye, Bye, Christmas Little trees. Town. Little town, it's quiet. That's the wrong country. Me. Not the one before. Oh, oh, oh. My love, to sing the right princess song. song. <laughs> Snow White, isn't it? And Rapunzel. Yeah. German. It's German, yeah. yeah. Rapunzel and Snow White. Beauty Beast is French. Yeah. But yeah. Again, let me say, there's the uh, Bye, dragon. dragon. So we we're heading back to the station and we realised that in Nuremberg, as well as Rothenburg, where we are now, you can climb, climb up the, the walls. Let's go around the city. You alright, Steph? Oh my They're so steep, aren't they? I'm going to die. And look, you can kind of see in between these. It goes all the way down here and across the entire area of Rothenburg, the city. We've got like half an hour to our train so we thought we'd kind of jump on here quick. Okay. Why not? Oh and apparently wasn't these people that donated money or something oh, on the yeah, restoration yeah. of the wall? Probably yeah. Yeah I think so I could be wrong but Ooh. This is like Chester Day because Care Phil, gosh. <clears throat> so steep. Yeah. One foot at a time, boys and girls. Bike scared me then. Yeah. I just popped out of nowhere. These steps are so big. Interesting things in the vending machine and we've got Gingerbread cookie twix. Spellulus. 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 Expelliarmus. We were at the station at Rothenburg waiting for a train because we were actually quite early. We were about like 20 minutes early. But we thought we'd try this out. Give it a little mini vending machine review. Go on then, Dave. Oh. Give it a sniff. It smells weird. Well, it's cold, which is what I like. Oh, I'd hate that. Good. A little bit ginger. <laughs> you can definitely tell there's ginger. Yeah. Actually quite a strong taste. Is it? It's really good though. It's gonna be hard. Oh very cheap. It's that hard you can snap it without the caramel melting. You can taste the ginger though. Oh yeah, it's good. It's not bad is it? Oh that was a cup of tea. Mmm. Now if you can see it on the camera, it's snowy. <laughs> It's not fake snow, it's real snow! Oh my god, that's amazing! So we have arrived at Anschbach station and it's still snowing. We've got like a 15 minute delay because our train was delayed before, but <laughs> Steffi's enjoying the snow. It's snowing! It's amazing! She's already started. She's already started and she's getting a snowball ready. Look at her. What, what are you doing there? What's in your hand? What are you doing? I'm stroking the floor. <laughs> so we have made it back to Nuremberg. Look, it's raining now. A little bit of snow. We've not entered this part of the wall before. It's nice. I found someone that was that had boots and I was like, I haven't got a boot. We haven't got a boot. So we got a boot. Oh were they? And they're marzipan. Oh. Chocolate. You know I love a marzipan. You know I love a marzipan. Dave got a waffle. Heart shaped waffle. Oh last Christmas. I gave you my heart. Oh. Oh. oh well. But the very next day. I don't want you to eat it away. <laughs> She'd never jump the gun.